Hello, everyone. My name is Zhong Yanke. I'm an AI algorithm engineer at Huawei. I'm honored to have this opportunity to speak to you today. And my, the topic of my speech is MindSports Foundation Model Platform Promotes the Ecological Development of Foundation Models. I divided my topic into three parts. First, I'll share my insights of AI development. In the era we live in today, there are three things that are that are expanding rapidly. The first is the continuous upgrading of hardware equipment, which has constant continuously improved the computing power of various devices. The computing power of smartphone process has reached 10 tera operation per second. And the second is the explosive growth of data volume. According to statistics, the volume of unstructured data has reached 44 zettabytes in 2020. And it's expected to reach uh, 180 zettabytes in 2025. The third is that the neural network model has been con continuous, continuously improved. And the number of model parameters has continued to increase. Now, mainstream foundation model such as GPT-3 can have hundreds of billions of parameters. And these three facts are driving AI into a golden age. Now in this golden age of AI, the mainstream direction of neural network model has gradually shifted from content understanding to generative models. In the past, traditional AI models were more about collecting data and training one specific model to solve specific problems, such as recommendation and prediction. Now, generative models have become mainstream, and more and more models are used to generate text, images, videos, and music, and so on. And a recent hot event is that a painting created by AI won the first prize at an art fair. It can be seen that quality of AIGC is constantly improving. Traditional AI scenarios use one specific model to fit a certain scenario. The number of model parameters is relatively small and the generalization performance is poor. This approach usually requires training a data, uh, training a model with a large amount of data in contrast. In the foundation model scenario, a model can adapt, adapt to a variety of scenarios that have strong generalization performance. The application of the model only needs to be fine-tuned with a small amount of data on the basis of foundation model. And the opportunity of foundation model means that the number of parameters of model is increasing rapidly. The number of parameters of foundation model can reach hundreds of billions, which means that training a Foundation model requires more computing power and data. So training a foundation model with good results requires a high investment. However, the foundation model also brings more advantages. For example, one model can cover multiple scenarios, reducing the cost of training different models. At the same time, due to the larger number of parameters, the foundation model can also break through the accuracy limit. And, and in the fine tune scenario, only a small amount of data is needed, which can reduce the cost of managing data labels. 
This advantage makes the rigorous development of foundation model inevitable. And all leading technology companies are laying out their own foundation models. This also requires an AI framework with more capabilities. And the importance of AI framework is gradually increasing. And next, uh, let's discuss the key topic of this issue, Minds4, which is an AI framework developed and open sourced by Huawei. With the increased importance of AI framework, the mainstream AI framework in the industry has begun to lay out the foundation model related technology. In 2020, Huawei open sourced a self developed AI framework Mindsball, which natively supports foundation model training from version 1.5, which launched in 2021. In November 2022, Mindsport 2.0 was released at the Huawei Connect conference. It's the industry's first fusion framework that supports scientific computing. The main updates of version 2.0 are as follows. First, version 2.0 further consolidates the full scenario capabilities, supports efficient federal learning, realized cross-domain parallel, parallel training of foundation models, and realized cross-platform deployment. In addition to existing static graph model, the this version fully supports the dynamic graph mode, which can balance development flexibility and execution performance and achieve a comprehensive upgrade in terms of ease of use. And second, this version builds a scientific computing acceleration library which uses automatic parallelism, heterogeneous acceleration, and optimization of AI and HPC tasks. And the third thing is that version 2.0 builds three major toolkits. Mindsball and an AI framework natively supports foundation model training and the key technology of foundation model par training is the parallelism capability. MySpore has multi-dimensional hybrid parallelism capabilities including data parallelism, model parallelism, pipeline parallelism and optimi optimizer parallelism. For foundation model memory consumption problem, MySpore has automatic precision compression and distributed data caching module in order to reduce the development cost of foundation model. MySpore provides high level APIs related to foundation models, such as transformer encoder and transformer decoder which are necessary structures for foundation models. As an open source project, the Mindsball community is constantly building and growing its ecology. Currently, the community has more than 11,000 community developers and 28 groups serving more than 55,000 companies and has 13 groups in 22 cities in China and seven foreign cities. There are already many foundation models based on MySpore, and MySpore is actively cooperating with university and research institutions to develop foundation models. There is the LLM. PCL series of foundation models 
jointly launched by Mindsball and the research laboratory. And the three model foundation models Dong Tai Chu launched by Mindsball and the Wuhan University. Mindsball natively supports the foundation model and there is still a lot of work to be done in terms of ecolog ecological development. Therefore, the Mindsport community has built the Mindsport Foundation Model Platform to promote the ecological development of Foundation Model. This slide shows the architecture of the entire platform. The platform is mainly divided into three parts. The bottom layer is the computing power center, is the foundation of the whole platform. And the middle layer is the tool layer. It provides tools for developers and upper applications. The top layer is the application layer, which directly drives the ecological development. The base computing model, module is connected to several computing centers in different areas. And it supports processors like CPU, GPU, ASEN. Uh, in terms of the tool layer, the platform has online model library and data sets available for download and directly online use. CoLab environment is uh, the online training and infer inference center where users can manage code based on Git, scheduling online files from model repository and datasets, and realize online training and inference. Also in the tool layer, we have pr property tools for foundation models. The foundation model online experience model and the foundation model fine tuning comp component. The whole tool layers helps to lower the threshold of AI development, especially for tasks that requires a lot of computing power such as training the uh, foundation model. The upper layer includes industry providing specific cases of Mindsport framework and foundation models in various industries and promoting the development of community cooperation. The company module is used to hold various AI competitions. And the course module provides many technical courses related to AI and foundation model. And the AI gallery is to um, help developers to know about foundation model. Now I will introduce the platform from bottom to top. The bottom layer is the computing power center. It's the core of the whole platform, which is necessary to reduce the cost and the threshold of financial model development. We have set up several computing centers and the data centers to provide free computing powers and storage functions for users. The computing power center flexibly, flexibly allocates computing power for the tasks assigned by the two layer, including online training, online inference, and online fine tuning. This forms the basis of the entire platform and then we can extend many application tools on it. The core of the tool layer is the CoLab environment. It links the model repository, code library, and datasets. Users start online training tasks through the training center. 
For online training, we provide two ways. The first way is the interface interaction. User selects the starting files and the corresponding data set and models through the interface and open the training mission directly. Then you can view the training log on real time. The second way is the Jupyter Notebook. The user selects the corresponding device to start a Jupyter Notebook and the Jupyter Notebook has built-in mailing toolkits and complete tutorials of MySpot, which users can train or debug. Uh, and it's recommended to use the interface for long-term training and use Jupyter Notebook for learning debugging. The online inference module are implemented based on Gradio. In this module, users can deploy their own inference mission or experience other users' public projects. The inference tasks of the platform are scheduled based on Kubernetes, and different inference tasks are isolated from each other. For example, if I find a style transfer project I'm interested in, and I can directly upload a photo and through the online inference, it will be converted into a Van Gogh style image. The foundation model experience module is a way to display the foundation model to the public. We provide several interfaces for foundation model experience. Users can directly try the foundation model inference through the interface. Taking the following three foundation models as example, the first foundation model is called the Wukong Hua Hua. It's based on the diffusion model, which can output a specific picture according to text description entered by the user. And the second model is Zidong Tai Chu. It has two missions to try, text to imaging and image to text. For example, the user input a photo and the model will output a, a summarize that explain the photo, which is the two polar bear playing the snow. And the third foundation model is Luojianet, which can perform target detection on images. User input an image and the target and spaces in the image will be marked and output. The industry module of the platform is one of the top level applications, including related cases in fields of electricity, industry, medical, and humanities. There are all landing cases based on MySpot. Some cases are adopted the foundation model to a certain industry, such as the Yuju Wukong image and text understanding model in the field of humanities. The display of these cases provides a case reference for the implementation of foundation model and also provides cases support for the fine tune and of the foundation model, which is also promotion for the ecological development of foundation model. The competition module is the core module of the application layer. It can attract many students and new developers to join the community, understand MySpot, and learn about the foundation model in depth. 
for developers of different level. The platform provides different types of combinations. The platform mainly cover three types of combinations. First, single stage combinations, suitable for beginners, which will be held frequently. And second is the double stage combinations, suitable for middle and high level developers. These competitions are held on a regular basis. In addition, every year we customize the theme according to the cutting edge theme of artificial intelligence. For example, this year we are holding an AI painter competition based on the diffusion model. The collab environment of the platform is provided to the participants for free, which lowers the <coughs> threshold of participation. The purpose of setting up the course module <coughs> is to lower the threshold of learning the foundation model, which is too difficult for developers with weak period knowledge to get started. Our course module is one-stop service of video course with homework and tutorials, and all of them are free. For example, we have now launched courses related to foundation models, which are suitable for developers of all stages. The course content includes basis of foundation models, key technologies of, of foundation models, and explanation of foundation model examples. And we also have other beginner courses and the transformer courses to attend. An AI gallery is the place where the platform showcases the AIGC images generated by the foundation model. It's like a photo wall. You can publish your generated paintings, and like and collect others' paintings. Here you can see a lot of beautiful AIGC imagine works. AIGC is a promising direction and the extension of AI gallery can also promote the development of AIGC. Now in the end, the driving force of my sport foundation model platform for the ecology development of foundation model can be summarized as follows. The three layer structure of the entire platform forms an ecological driven close the loop. Thank you for your listening. Here are websites related to MySport. Everyone is very welcome to join the MySport community.